so just to explain for a second what this thing is, since I'm restarting the recording, it's an AT Games Sega Genesis 60 and one emulator that has 30 Genesis games and 30 of its own library. We're gonna test out first Sonic 3D Blast. Is that okay? Yeah, because we just found out it has a sound test. So that'll be good because it seems like this thing can't handle more than a couple layers of sound. That scream and that sounds so good. test it on definitely it doesn't help that this is an hd tv so yeah. even though that doesn't affect the sound it affects the visuals pretty bad no it just shows it for what it really is it shows its true colors so yeah it can't handle more than two or three layers of sound i guess and like as you change these it gets progressively worse the way there. <laughs> also for anybody that does watch this this thing comes with two wireless infrared controllers but the connectivity is so bad it makes the games really hard to play including the menu screen it seems like yeah it is a little hard to hold Controller a certain way. Is it still the same thing as Streets of Rage where it's like icy? Almost. <clears throat> yeah. Flickies! Flicky is another game that sounds like total crap on here though. Infrared is shit. Never really. It's a bad idea that we might use it. Huh? It's a bad idea that we might use it with like TV remotes. Yeah. But you know why I think TV remotes do it? Yeah. So they break easier, or so somebody breaks them and you have to buy a new one because Comcast sells extra remotes for like 10 bucks. Yeah. Or not 10 yeah. bucks, but it's it fairly expensive to get a spare. I think the, uh, on the uh, No, they charge the What? They, they charge an initial amount for a deposit for the remote, I think. Ah. Or something like that. You get it back. I don't know. Maybe I don't know. What the fuck do I know? <laughs> anyway, it's not about me and my non-relationship with Han. Podcast. It's about how Sonic is so hard to play. <laughs> and it's about AT Games and their decent looking but poorly playing emulator. You want to go to a different game? I think we should test out the original Sonic now that you just lost your ring so people can really see how that one looks and sounds. Yeah, because that's the popular one. And then we'll go to another game. Okay. Really? I think Sonic 3 would be the most popular, wouldn't it? Then go to Sonic 3, because honestly, Sonic the first one is the one everybody tests with this system. Sonic 3 ain't on here. It's only Sonic 2. Uh, That's already a demerit in this thing's yeah, direction. Sonic and Knuckles is Sonic 3. Oh, is it? Yeah. Okay. That sounded awful. This is how I broke my Sega controller. I'm about to break this one along with it. This is Isn't it though? Yeah, yeah, this is oh. You're about to barf, aren't you? You know, it just sounds more jazzy. You, want, you know what I want to uh, hear on this? I think it was this system that had a port of Doom to it, but that actually had good audio. I want to hear that on here. Okay. 
I don't think it, this has it, though. I don't think this game has Doom. Or this console, I don't think, has Doom. This is and to anybody that does watch this, this isn't him sucking at the game. This is the controller. No, this is my game. Trust me. Yeah, I know you're good at this. This is just a crappy controller. I, we gotta retry this with Genesis controllers. Uh, I kind of forget what they did. It's been so long. They bring you all the way up to the top platform. I thought so, but I was having trouble climbing up. And now I can't reach it? You <clears throat> might need to restart the level. Or just give up? No, I got it. I guess it doesn't do anything but help you avoid the enemy. What? Ah. I gotta do something with that mushroom. I'm pretty sure you're supposed to use the mushroom to get onto the upper part then. I got it. I'm not stupid no more. I just can't get over how bad it sounds. I know exactly what I'm supposed to do. I know, I know exactly what I'm going to do because I want to. <laughs> I don't know how that was supposed to help me. <laughs> what the F? Yeah. yeah, that ain't going up any further. Yeah, um, I can't see what to do with this. <clears throat> I'm still gonna blame it on the controller. I forget. Maybe I just forget. How long's it been since you played this? How long has it been since my controller's broken? No, since you played this. Yeah, which my controller broke. I don't think I even had it said. Do you want to try with another game to see how this runs another one? Yeah, and plus... I'm fucking up. <laughs> Notice that, like, static once you do go to the menu, too. That bothers me. Can we try Alex Kidd? Because that one I actually like, kind of. It's almost like their version of Mario. Huh? You ever play this? Mm -mm. And after this, I want to try Flicky. If you don't mind. just the controller. I know what to do, because I've played oh. this game a few times. It's just this controller. Yeah. It has a lag. You notice that? Yeah. I did when I was trying to And it's not the most responsive thing ever, because when you notice it lag, your hands want to tilt up. Stop shaking me. I'm... Sorry. Uh, but yeah, I see what you mean like that, right? Yeah. Everything kills you. It does it to me, so it gets me down to... Oh, God. I'm gonna switch to Flicky real quick. Okay? Yeah, because this... For anybody watching this, i pretty sure my mom bought this thing at Walgreens for about... Sixty dollars. So given that price tag, this thing ain't bad. Like you were saying, it is thirty Sega like Genesis games, but you can always emulate these games if there are better emulators out there. Yeah, now, if you're savvy enough to, I mean, I'm about to put on one of my 
favorite Genesis games because it's one of the only ones I'm actually good at. And this is where I really noticed the drop in the sound quality and the drop in the visual quality. Here we go with Flicky. Have you ever played this? Uh, I've not. It's fine. Notice the pitch. This one I'm only going to play for a minute to get through the first couple levels. Because, yeah, it's mostly a test at this point. Now, I really fucked up that that portion of the level, but... Good. No, usually it only takes me five seconds flat. There's no more in the level. That was snappy, I'm sorry, but no, there's no more than six in the first set of levels. I believe it does increase, but I forget, because it really has been a few years since I played this game. Okay. I love this round, but I kind of messed it up earlier. See what I mean? It doesn't help that this thing again is icy feeling. I didn't do well just because I used to play the hell out of this, so considering that, I really did mess up. Also, to viewers, again, I apologize for the video slipping. I have it between my knees, so, yeah. Yeah, I have this thing held between my knees, so there's obviously not going to be the most focus on the screen. You want me to hold it? No. Oh, you try to echo or something? No. Okay. Trust me, I don't want it held. I'm going to stick with how I have it. Thanks, though. Uh, should I show some of the built-in games or keep showing some of these ones first? So, show some building games. Alright. Hey, did you ever play Vector Man? Because I've tried this one once on here. It's actually not bad. It's a kind of cool platformer. Alright, so here's where I'm going to mostly read these off. Air Hockey Black Sheep is pretty fun. You've never played any of these since they're built into this system, that's, right? That's a knockoff of Bomberman, isn't it? Bomber. Uh, Looks like it. I think so. I remember playing another knockoff like that on Neopets back when I was on there. It was in their Ice World, but I forget what the actual game was. Bottle, bo uh, bleh, bottle Taps Race is kind of fun, actually, but not with this controller. This is what the controller looks like, by the way. And it's Show not the bad. Show them the infrared. Up there is the infrared part while my camera focuses. It has a switch up here for player one, player two. So they can be for either, but it's not even worth trying, really. It That absolutely sucks in this regard. Then we have our Feeding Frenzy ripoff. That's actually kind of fun. But again, not with the infrared controller. Especially because... The D-pad sucks. Uh, memory isn't bad. Memory match is basically the same game. Mr. Balls is just weird. In its defense, Sega didn't have the best D-pad either. No. I broke mine off. Two controllers. Yeah, it really wasn't that good. But for $60, I expect something a little bit better than this. Just a little bit, because this feels like a universal TV remote more than anything. Yeah. Uh, ooh, snake! 
a really bad version of Snake. Do you mind if I play this one for a second? Go for it. I love Snake. How can, how can you ruin Snake like that? Ow! <coughs> how do you ruin Snake like that? With a bad controller and a boot. Oh god, good luck. Look at how slow this is. Oh my god. You know what was better than this? Uh, I can't hear you right now. Okay, you know what was actually better than that? What? Snake on my old Nokia cell phone. Yeah. That was actually snake, better. Snake on YouTube. On the middle of a YouTube video, you can play Snake. Hopefully yeah. this one doesn't take as long to, or this video won't take long enough to load where that's a problem. But I believe if you hit pause while it's buffering, and then do the up or right, you might be right. arrow key, I think that's how you get it. Yeah, I'm not even playing that one again. I'm gonna do probably one or two more games on here and then call it quits, I think. Mean Bean Machine. Mind if I play this one? Do you ever no, play this? No. It's Tetris, but with Dr. Robotnik's Mean Beans. Awesome. It is. And, and this one like actually... <laughs> no, this one actually might run okay. I forget. Yeah, I mean, Tetris starts out slow. I'm gonna go exercise mode, so I don't know how well this is gonna run. Okay, this one runs fine with this controller, actually. It wouldn't run okay competitively, but it runs okay on this one. It just sounds awful. Notice the skipping that it just did, too. Are you gonna try two-player? Yeah. Alright, hit easiest. Ah! Hit easiest. Because honestly, you're not going to get play out of any other setting. Oh, you know what you just did? Mm. By you hitting two-player, you messed up mine, because it's trying to read both controllers. Oh. That's where part of our issue was. You know? Okay. Does that actually do it? It, it obviously does. Because once you started playing, you fucked up mine. Mm. Unless it's just conveniently timed, but I doubt that. Mm. But I used to be pretty good at this one, because this game Brienne and I played a lot. I played the Mario version. Dr. Mario, right? Nope. Um... Tetris Attack. Tetris yeah. Nintendo. I love that one. The animation on that is adorable. I love it. We gotta get that game, because I would so kick your ass in that one. Alright. Uh, kick my ass in this one. Well, this is the controller. You cannot test my skills on this one. Okay. Alright. I think I'm better with the controller with you than you. Okay, but I just said you messed me up by logging into the game. I know, I'm not fighting with you. It also doesn't help that, I don't know if you noticed that the game sped up a minute ago. Yeah, it did for you, not, not for me. Because you started, started after. Yeah, me. I started after you. Okay, wait, so. Yeah, it's good enough for me now, so it's like getting hard for me. 
and then you'll really see what I mean, right? Yeah. Because it can't handle, this thing can't seem to process speed very well. Mm -hmm. These controllers really can't process it, that's the issue. Yeah, yeah I'm about to fucking quit. This is balls. Pun intended. Oh. Okay, do you people see this now? You see how easy it is for me? They're just like falling right into place. Lucky bastard, shut up. Now it's not even doing anything. Barely. I agree. <laughs> I'm player one, and I'm just gonna let it quit. I'm gonna let yours finish out while I watch, okay? okay. See what I mean now? That was lucky, yeah. That was very lucky. Huh. I mean, you get used to the music, but it takes a while. I kind of like this one. I was thinking because it was like, his mean beat, Doctor Robotnik's mean beans. I kind of like this one just because it it's sounds very electronic. It doesn't help, though, that you also have kind of tinny speakers. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> My speakers aren't the best test. Thing too, either. No, but even on the YouTube videos I showed you, it does sound like this even on better recording equipment. Oh God, you're being horrible! You can't react to this! Your controller can't react to it more more like accurately. Yeah. <laughs> Never again. <laughs> Alright, any other games you want to test out on here? Should we see one more of the built in? Yeah, play me chess. <laughs> First, I want to show you this. Alright. And then, I, uh, All right, I'm can... telling you, I'm terrible in chess. Do not make fun of me. I'm not. I'm never going to make fun of you in chess. I'm going to teach you how to play chess. Not on video, you're not. Okay. This is basically RC Pro-Am, but shitty. Have you ever played that? RC Pro-Am? On the NES. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing right now. Basically, you see that power gauge? Yeah. Oh. You don't want to touch the edge. Get it? Yeah. I think it somehow only went one player. That's the problem. Oh. Okay. See, that's what you're really supposed to do. Oh. I'm blue for those that don't know what the hell's going on, by the way. Me. <laughs> <laughs> this one doesn't even let you pick directions, it just like inches you along. It lets you pick to some extent. Yeah, I'm bored of this. You guys saw that game, so have fun. This is turning into like a half hour thing, so let's definitely try chess and then call it quits. Yeah. Fair. Yeah. You might need to hit start on yours again. See how bad this looks. You don't have to video this if you don't want to. Alright, then we're we're gonna call this video quits. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you realize this thing is still fun, even though it sounds like crap. Like, if you want a good emulator, get it and just play the original game's audio somehow else. 
Thank you guys again for watching. Say bye. Bye.